How does something as simple and innocent as a Tribute F1 crash helmet design turn into a borderline international incident? Charles Leclerc's special Gilles Villeneuve crash helmet became one of the biggest talking points of the Canadian Grand Prix when he stopped using it because it had apparently upset the Villeneuve family. The matter was eventually cleared up so Leclerc could race the design, so what actually happened? According to Jacques Villeneuve, his sister, who looks after everything relating to their dad's legacy, was upset that Leclerc chose to use the design without notifying the family first. There was also reported to be some discomfort about how prominently a bunch of Ferrari sponsors featured on the design, perhaps turning it into more of a marketing tool than a simple tribute. After having what Jacques called a heartfelt conversation, Leclerc apologised to the family, invited them to the track, posed for photos and took the helmet back out where it belonged, on the track that carries Gilles' name. It seemed to come down to a simple oversight from the Leclerc camp not to mention it in advance to the Villeneuve family. Jacques called it an unnecessary controversy and we'd have to agree.